Well, today the University of Dayton is honoring those who have served our country or are currently serving. A special mass celebrated in their honor this afternoon on campus. And 2 News reporter Adam Reif has more from the Chapel of the Immaculate Conception. Father Kip Stander's message today focused on mission, not just blessing and protecting those currently serving and those who have served, but how the rest of the community can use their example as a way to live their lives every day. We seek to have everyone learn, lead, and serve. And this is a special way of serving our country, and we want to honor them for doing that and to encourage them in their lives and in their continued growth in their lives. Father Kip Stander celebrating a special Mass on campus Monday. He says honoring veterans for their gifts means not just the qualities they possess, but the security they provide. University President Eric Spina spoke briefly before the Mass. To all veterans and to all our RTC cadets joining us at this Mass, thank you for your service, your leadership, your dedication, and your sacrifices. Father Stander says the readings chosen Monday focus on mission, on a service member's purpose while in uniform, and on our mission to help and serve the community. At the end of Mass, active duty service members and veterans stood to be blessed by the congregation. Some of the students can see these other men and women who have done great things already with their lives, challenging things. They've weathered the storm, and it gives them some, some hope and some encouragement as they continue on their pathway. Among the intentions read at today's Mass was a reading of the names more than two dozen University of Dayton students and alumni have given their lives in service to our country over the years. Adam Reif, 2 News, working for you.